Welcome to the Pilates Show Mondays outside the Pilates studio, where we take our Pilates body and brain out into the real world. I'm your host, Elizabeth Goyer, and today we're going to be talking about surviving a stressful day at work. So many of us work either from home or in an office where we're sitting at a computer all day, and when something gets stressful, we can get thrown into this feedback loop. So stress in our mind creates tension in our body, we start to feel the pain, the pain makes us feel more stressed out, we're trying to get something done, and we may have this upper back, lower back tension going on that can be really debilitating. So I have a three-step strategy to help deal with that, and it requires just three items. First, water bottle. Second, any type of grounding pillow. I brought two today. One is the Smart Spine Disc. The second one is just a nice, you know, rice-filled pillow, smells kind of nice, you can heat it up. Um, third is your lungs, impossible to forget those. So make sure you have your water, your pillows, and your lungs. So first, I'm gonna take this pillow, and if it's warm, if it's, warm it's better. I'm gonna put it on my seat and just create a little divot for my sit bones, and then sit back on it. If I don't have a smart spine pillow, I can just take my grounding pillow, and just put it on over my knees, anything to just kind of weight my legs down and help me feel a little more settled. Water, super essential. When we have body tension, a lot of the time it's because our connective tissue is dry and dehydrated, and so drinking some water right away can be extremely helpful and just to interrupt that cycle of stress and tension. Next, we're going to go into a couple of our Pilates breathing exercises that we learn in class, but you can do them sitting in the chair just fine. First one is going to be the belly breath. So we're going to put our hands on our belly and just take a deep inhale and expand into your hands and then exhale. And again, inhale. Remember the effort is on the inhale and then as we exhale, we relax. You can find more length in your spine and one more deep breath in. Big belly breath here, and then exhale. Our second breath is a lateral rib cage breath. I like to put my hands on my ribs here so I can feel them coming away from each other. So on this breath, it's an inhale. Ribs come away from each other, breathing into the mid and upper back, and then exhale. Ribs fall away. Again, inhale. Ribs coming away from each other, and exhale. Growing taller, and again, inhale. And then exhale, no tension in the neck, upper back. And once we've done those three steps, the whole body is able to reset so we can move forward and have a great day. That's all for today. Thank you for joining us. Feel free to comment on our forum, our Facebook, or our Twitter.